sorry. I want to identify who's here uh, for the, from the American Legion. What, what several of you fellows and gals know me. I'm Dale Tippett. I'm the commander this year for the 9th District. We got 22 American Legion posts that represent 2,700 veterans in the community. And we go from just east of here out to like uh, Palatine and then down to uh, Mel um, North Lake. And so we got a pretty good area. Um, but there's 22 posts with 2,700 of us that are out here. So this is Law Enforcement Appreciation Day. We just wanted to come out and say thank you, just so you know that you know we're out there. We got your back as best as we can. Uh, but um, the local posts that I had put in the paper, at least that we, that we were looking to go ahead and have uh, up here today, the first post commander is uh, Pete Hurt from Building Caldwell Post 806. And if you'll see when you're running around on Irving, just east of Laramie there, the, the, the front of the building's been removed and now they're updating. That used to be our old post home. We were at 5116 West on Irving Park Road. So, but now we're, uh, we meet at various places, including the, the, the community room here. Uh, we we're, we want to make mention of Gladstone Park 777 post. And they do meet here. Uh, they haven't met for a while, obviously, for obvious reasons. But they have a lot of police officers in their post. Likewise, we have a lot of police officers in our post. Also, Edison Park 541. And they, um, I talked to the commander there, beautiful young lady named Laura Finley, and she's the commander. And she, uh, they were making arrangements to bring uh, pizza over here and, and for the different uh, watches, is what I, when I spoke to her uh, yesterday. And so uh, she's not here, but she's working. And then what's the other post? Uh, oh, you got displays? Uh, well, this plane, but he's one of the officers. That's out of this plane. But we have Billy Caldwell. Oh, Portage Park. Portage Park Post, which is Ray Tozak. His picture is up on the board there from when he was a young guy in Germany serving during the Vietnam uh, War. Oh, so Ray Tozak is a service <laughs> officer who connects veterans with their benefits. It's a critical position, and he works for the, um, the American Legion, and he's also the Portage Park uh, Post Commander. You've got four posts that are like right around in the neighborhood here. And then, um, as Commander Hurt was saying, this gentleman here, he's um, Greg Jacobs. He's the senior vice commander for the 9th District. Uh, Greg will be coming, becoming commander uh, next year. And so we'll be seeing more of, of Greg, obviously. And we've got Josephina Francis, who's our uh, public relations person. We've got Jim Koska, who's our um, Sergeant at Arms, uh, this gentleman here uh, 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 with the BFW jacket on, he's our historian. Multi and you'll see there's different caps. We belong to multiple different veterans organizations, and they're all about, you know, mom and apple pie, you know, God and country. Uh, I already introduced you to Al Coughlin and Mrs. Coughlin, Sue Coughlin, who is the uh, uh, president of the state of Illinois auxiliary. She represents 20,000 auxiliary. We've got a spouse who'd like to get involved. And then also, um, um, this good looking guy with the VFW hat on there, he's a Vietnam veteran. Barney uh, Duffner. And uh, introduce yourself again. I'm sorry, I just rattled off. Uh, my name is Barney Duffner. Barney. I'm with Parr, belong to River Grove, I belong to VFW and the American Legion. So I get out of the house. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. And there's also, if you're not yourselves but say your mother was or your father was there's an organization within the legion called the sons of the american legion and i'm a dual member of the american legion and also <coughs> myself like barney and then i'm also qualified because of my dad and my grandfather who served in world war ii and world war one for uh, the sons of the american legion Well, thank you all. So it's 11 o'clock. Let's just go ahead and open. I'm going to open up for the word of prayer. I'm the chaplain for Billy Caldwell Post. Peace. Our commander. So, commander, may I open up for the word Please. of prayer? Please. Thank you. So, one cover. Oh, God, our Father almighty and merciful, in whose name we seek to serve our country as veterans through the American Legion, we ask your blessing upon the police officers of this district, the 16th district here in Jefferson Park, Chicago, Illinois. 
whom we recognize today. Please, God, endue them with wisdom, patience, and generosity. May they be dedicated to serving you, our God, in this city with honor and integrity. May their time and talents be offered freely in guiding the fortunes of this district in the year ahead. And may we, who have chosen them to serve and protect us, offer them the support and cooperation so necessary to their success. May our objectives, activities, and lives follow your will that we may receive your blessings. All this we ask in the name of our God. Amen. 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 Recover. <clears throat> so, um, I don't have a lot to say other than to say thank you. Uh, I've known several of you. I've been part of the district advisory committee here for over 10 years. And um, everything that I've ever had to do with the Chicago police has been wonderful. And um, we need to go ahead and, and lift, lift you up in, in, in appreciation. Um, there's something that uh, I always tell the cops when I see them on the street, you know, my favorite show is Chicago TV. And they said, oh, we can't do that anymore. We can't do that anymore. But the, 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 the hero of the show, I got to say this, he's, uh, he's a sergeant, and uh, he's, he's, he's out there, okay? But, you know, in one of their commercials, they said something that I think it cuts to the chase, or he said something. And he says, and I think that this represents the real people of Chicago, all people, minus the politics, but they're all looking for this. You have the right to feel protected on our streets, talking to the people. Also, our children have a right to never fear their future. And three, lastly, you can't hope for safety. It's our job to deliver. And with those, I think that encapsulates, I know how I feel about you all. And I know the people that I come in contact with, which are a lot throughout the city, they feel that way too. So on behalf of the 9th District American Legion, Department of Illinois, uh, here in uh, the front of this detail, and whoever can watch this, I want to thank each and every one of you. God bless you all. Thank you. Thank you. Thanks a lot, officers. Thank Appreciate you. it. Thank you for everything you do. Thank you. Thank you. So, open up for comments, pictures. Uh, whoever wants to view the subpoena, you want to work with Drake, whatever you want to take a picture. <laughs> That's a group if we can go up there. Okay. You can stand up.